my darks and lights at the same time. That's not too bad. Okay, well, I've realised that we need some more space, so I'm just going to combine a little bit of light. There and there. A little bit more full in shape. Red, I think. Just in here to separate some of the tree shapes. The idea to um, put these paddocks in to warm the colour is to help the other tonal values recede. Making them a touch taller will help create a bit more of an overview. There's a little bit of a fence line on here which will give us uh, the idea of a ridge and a paddock. Right now in this area here I just want to make that a little bit softer. We don't have those two those tufts of grass making it too um, enclosed in so right now I'll just get a small brush and we'll put in a couple of uh, birds a couple of little white cockies that we had come through before but the height of birds the height that birds create is one way of cre creating some nice distance in the landscape these ones here can be just a little bit bigger there and there I'm happy as to how it's all gone so far it's not too bad it's just working wet and wet you sort of tend to uh, lose a lot of freshness because your colors blend but you know if you've still got a little bit of time later on we'll just put some more details in. There we go. Not too bad. <laughs>